what, what goes around sort of comes around, and I'm planning to fight a positive campaign focused on the, the local issues and um, try and be as nice as I, I, I can, obviously, to the electorate, but also to my opponents. <laughs> I, I hope my, uh, my shift to UKIP and the campaign we're, we're, we're fighting is going to be uh, pushing us towards the forefront of the, uh, the, the, the UKIP uh, campaign. And I think we've got a fighting chance of winning here. And uh, I'm fighting for every vote um, as positively as I can and uh, focused on the local issues. Mm. I've been getting a, a very good reception on the, on the doorstep, certainly a better reception than I ever recall getting as a, a, a Conservative. And many people who've said that you know, they appreciate what I've, what, 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 what I've done, whether in terms of fending off Boris's plans for uh, an airport in the area, whether getting investment into our new train station in Rochester or our, our new, new street, street Academy and a, a university technical college. And I'm finding a lot of people actually who you know, recognise what I've been doing on those issues but perhaps wouldn't vote for, for, we'll for me because time. they didn't like the Conservatives are now you know, enthusiastically coming behind me now I'm the UKIP candidate. Give my best wishes and uh, some of the local policies we have. And what do you think of Mr Reckless changing his mind, going from Conservative to UKIP? Very brave. Yeah. Uh, yeah, take a bit, I think it took a bit of guts to do that. I mean, what, what UKIP is about is, is I mean, not just getting, getting power back from the European Union. I understand that there are some Conservatives, particularly those you know, at the top of the constituency party or have been more active, uh, who are, you know, are, are upset, sometimes angry with the decision I've made. I came in, into politics to, to change things, to make this a better, better country, and in particular, um, to restore our, our nation's independence. We should, be, we should trade with Europe, but, but govern ourselves. And I didn't feel we were delivering on promises as the Conservatives, so yeah, therefore I've joined UKIP to try and keep what I promised to the electorate in, in 2010. Well, I've known him to be an upstanding, decent member of the community for, for many years. That's very good. Mm -hmm. Never liked him. <laughs> <but he's laughs> I think that was a joke. <laughs>